Hi, and it's Rob from Black Book, and I'm here with Guy. And Guy's setting up a new scheme, it's a bit special, and I just want to hear more about it. So could you just tell everyone what you're, what you're doing? Okay, um, well, I'm a very old lapper, been doing it for a long time. I had a lot of spare kit floating around, as I know a lot of old lappers do. Um, and there are quite a few people, new people joining LARP, certainly recently. So I decided that I wanted to lend kit out, but I want to make it a bit more official, a bit more useful and user-friendly so other people can get hold of it. So I set up something called Kit Library. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, so we, basically I can lend out um, kit. People can access a website. They can um, find out what kit I've got, uh, book it pre-event, and uh, I can lend out the kit on the day. I also bring extra kit to events for those players that may not know about Kit Library or may change character mid-game. Awesome. So when you're, being, you're bringing it to events, so the, it's, it, I guess it's going to be specific events that it yeah, happens on? Yeah, I am looking in logistics how I could take it to other events. Yeah. But at the moment, to keep costs down, to keep logistics easy, it's yeah. just the events I'm attending, which is primarily Curious Pastimes, um, but I also do some ILARPs and things like that. Yeah. So if you're at any of those events, those are the kind of, place, those are the kind of places they can expect to be able to yeah, maybe get I've something. always got extra kit with me. So um, the, the website, you can uh, narrow down which events you want to go to. Yep. So you can see what kit's still available. Yep. Um, so you can pre-book or you can turn up on the day hoping I've brought something that will be available and suitable for your character. So with fingers crossed on the day. It is. Um, the kit library is not big enough yet. I, I still bring, bring most of it. Yep. However, I'm getting a lot of donations of kit from various players. So at some point it's going to be I'll take what I think is going to be useful. That's cool. You mentioned the website. Yes. What, what, what is it? How do people find it? Right, the website's address is kit-library.uk. Okay. Um, and it's like a shop. I mean, I've picked up basically a shop website and yep. just taken out the prices. So you can browse through the kit. Um, it, there's a, a part of the a, a cart a shopping cart if you like yeah which will then email me what, what kit you want to is available that's okay you think about the prices so is there any cost in using kit library uh to the user nominally no mm -hmm. um i've said i want this to be a free service to people yeah um however there are two potential costs yeah one for expensive kit for those players that i don't know just for safety reasons i may ask for a refundable deposit okay um if kit gets damaged or broken we will discuss afterwards most times i will just say fine it happens we're in a, a, a contact sport, as it were. Things yeah. are going to get damaged. Um, but if something's obviously been abused, I would negotiate some kind of recompense for that. Understood that, yeah. So the library is kit-library.uk. Yeah. And are there any social media people can pick, it, pick this up on as well? Um, yes. Uh, the kit library is funded through a Twitch page, uh, through okay. a Twitch site. Um, I call myself Eldine Tux, E L D I N T U X. Right. On Facebook, there's also an Eldine Tux Facebook page, cool. um, which I try and keep updated. Primarily, Eldine Tux is about painting model figures, mm -hmm. but with always the idea that is what is funding the kit library. Perfect. Okay, thank you so much, and I hope it all goes really well for you. Thank you very much. <laughs> thank nice you. To be here. Thank you. Okay, then th th thank you all very much for watching. And if you like this, don't forget to subscribe to Laugh Book. Okay, thank you all.